Hey, it's Biddy Penny. Welcome back to my channel. The props for this week's collage are something folded, housework, an ocean creature, a random piece of washi tape, and the bonus, oh, an art scrap, and then wrapping paper was the bonus. So I have this beautiful hero art stamp set that I got in Happy Mail that a sweet friend sent me and I've always wanted to use it and just haven't yet. So today's prompts are perfect. You guys, I if you missed it, I did a video on finding a theme and I think my theme for this week just came together beautifully. <laughs> It just all fit in my happy little brain. I guess I should say it made my little brain happy. <laughs> so I have this random art scrap, if you will. This is the cleanup from my previous collages that I've made this year. And um, it is going to be my background. I'm going to end up just tearing this down with my ruler to fit on my page. And so I just stamped on top of that. I really love these colors. I've always loved pink and yellow together. And then they kind of blended in the middle and made this gorgeous like kind of coral orange color. It's really, really pretty. And um, I love that it looks kind of washed out, um, which goes with washing. My chore that I picked was laundry. It is my least favorite chore you guys. I do not like dealing with laundry. My least favorite part is actually just hanging laundry up. I don't mind the washing and drying so much, uh, the folding, uh, and then the hanging stuff up. I don't know what it is. I have a block there. <laughs> anyway, so you can see that laundry is hanging on the line, but we're going to take it a lot further than that. Um, so I kind of came up with the, when I saw sea creature, I was like, octopus. <laughs> so I'm going to build a whole scene um, and there's going to be an octopus. But first, I'm going to ground my scene with this gorgeous wrapping paper. My mom wrapped one of my Christmas gifts in this this year. She had wrapped a birthday gift in it, and I was like, oh my gosh, that is my favorite wrapping paper of all time. And so she saved some and wrapped my Christmas gift in it too. Oh, such a sweet mommy. So um, I'm so glad that now this paper has like a permanent home and one of my journals that I'll be keeping. So I tear some of that down, and that is going to be kind of my ocean floor. Um, doesn't look like a regular ocean floor, but it is blue. <laughs> and then, you know, one of the other prompts was um, a random piece of washi tape. So I just knocked that one right out of the, just get it out of the way. And so I just taped some down. That was really easy. And then something folded. So since it's laundry, I was like, and I wanted something to open up on my page and unfold. So I decided I would kind of build a washing machine to go uh, on my page. And I'm just kind of playing around here thinking about how I want to engineer this. And we have... Uh, a top loading washing machine and so I was thinking originally about tearing it here on the corners and kind of making like a top loading washing machine where when you open the lid the octopus would pop out and I could engineer that and I'm still thinking about it here contemplating it but eventually I will decide that mm, let's take an easier route and um, I will do a washing machine that's front loading. Plus the bonus there is that you can see the octopus the whole time. And I think that makes it even more fun for this particular page. So this is where I'm kind of deciding, hmm, 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 what am I gonna do? 
and I will decide to cut that off. I probably should have edited that down a little bit more for you guys, but oh well, you see more of the process this way. So now I grab, I was thinking of punching out a hole, but then I took it even easier and I grabbed my glue dots roll and I'm just gonna make a circle and I don't even cut it out. I just grab my stamp set. I'm using two stamp sets today. I'm using this Hero Arts Octopus stamp set and a waffle flower one that has clothing. And so what I'm gonna do is actually just stamp this guy out a couple of times and I got my color um, ideas on this from the back of the stamp set. So I'm using um, a mermaid and a navy so like a dark turquoise and a navy color. And I'm actually gonna stamp him out twice while I had my stamp sets out and I, I just felt like I would need it. Sometimes I like to stamp out things, even if I think I only need one, I'll stamp it out two, three, four times and then I'll put the extras back into my stamp set and it's always a nice surprise when I think, oh, I need an octopus and I go back and I have three or four already stamped. That's always a bonus. <laughs> so you might consider that. I really love it with that dark navy blue details. It really makes this guy pop. All right, so I'm gonna use the same glue dot roll here and I'm gonna make the same circle around here on my stamped image and I'm going to cut that out. Now I keep all those extra, are those tentacles? I, I don't know. Um, but I keep all of his hands and feet uh, because I'm going to use those throughout my page and I'm just going to glue this on like so. So easy. And then on the inside, well, first I need a handle so I can open the door, right? <laughs> we all need a handle. So I just cut something real simple out of my scrap cardstock and used a black marker and made myself a very simple little handle there. And now we'll get to the inside. I just did some very simple drawing here for my um, modes and buttons, dials. So nothing too complicated. Once I had that done, then I brought in the stamp set with the clothing and stamped all of this out. I hope you guys are enjoying the series. I love this series. Um, just because it's so much fun to make. And I have been really enjoying finding other creators here on YouTube by following the hashtag. I've been subscribing and finding lots of new people who love collage just like me. And I think that makes it extra fun. So definitely, you know, if this is something that you are enjoying, then click that hashtag and go watch some other people as well. You may find um, some delightful new channels just like me. So I had to use this stamp, uh, this sentiment from the stamp set. It says, need a hand. Um, yeah, with laundry, I sure do. So I had to put that up there. And then I used this coral um stamp that was also in the hero art stamp set and I'm just gonna stamp a bunch of coral all around now I get it I stamped this like red coral I know it's not I know that the red corals usually died but whatever I'm just stamping this around and I like it and then I will um be stamping out some clothing to go around. I just love this dress. I love this stamp set. I don't have it in front of me and I don't know what it's called. It's really retired. <laughs> like it's from years ago, but me and Sparkle Heart have used it many, many times. It's so funny. It's not one of those stamp sets that I bought thinking, oh, 
I will use it for five different reasons. Some stamp sets just surprised me. Does that happen to you guys? Y'all just get some and you use it and you go back to it again and again and again and it just like surprises you that you do? This is one of those for me. Anyway, so now I have some random pieces of clothing and like I said, I saved those scrappy little tentacles or whatever they are um, to put around like, you know, because I'm getting some help from the octopus and the dress and I did um, write out some sentiments as well it says I'd like to be under the sea with an octopus folding my laundry I think we all know what tune that came from um, I did use the other octopus and I put him in the washing machine just because I really wasn't a fan of how that inside was turning out and it made more sense for him to really match up with the outside I'm going to trim off the edges and that's pretty much it. I think this spread was so much fun. I certainly had a good time making it. I hope you found inspiration by watching it. And here is how it turned out. Just a little close up for you all. Thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you next time. Bye. Mm -hmm.